Bob Cajun, nestled in the heart of the Quartha Lakes region of Ontario, this place is more than just a catchy, tragically hip song. Stick around as we reveal the pros and cons of Bob Cajun, one star at a time. Oh boy. You might be surprised to know that with the lakes, the locks, and the miles and miles of outdoor fun to be had, tourism isn't our main industry in the Quartus. Well, what would that be? It's agriculture, Dean. Okay. It becomes obvious when you see the many farmers markets, roadside farm stands, and of course, we've got Mariposa Cheese in Lindsay and Kawartha Dairy with its main headquarters right here in Bob Cajun. Kawartha Dairy is a true community success story. It was founded here in Bob Cajun in 1937, but it wasn't until the mid 50s that they would introduce ice cream to their lineup. Mm. Today, the operation includes 10 retail outlets and numerous wholesale products. You can find Kawartha Dairy in the frozen section of stores all over the province. But one of the sweetest perks of living in Bob Cajun is strolling down the charming streets on a warm summer day, ice cream in hand, with the scent of freshly made waffle cones wafting through the air. Kawartha Dairy ice cream is not just a treat. And it's an experience that you'll find yourself indulging in more often than you'd like to admit. Trust me, those cravings will keep you coming back for more. Certainly. Now that you've had your sweet treat, let's talk about living on the water. Okay. Bob Cajun isn't just a town. It's a collection of three islands nestled between Sturgeon and Pigeon Lakes. Whether you live directly on the water or off water in town, the lakeside cottage lifestyle is braided into the community fabric. Imagine waking up to the gentle lapping of water against the shore and enjoying your morning coffee with a stunning lakeside view. Living here is like being on a perpetual vacation, with opportunities for fishing, boating, and simply soaking in the natural beauty that surrounds you. Lock 32, the first lock constructed on the Trent Severn Waterway, sits in the heart of the community. It's a very popular lock station for tourists, as it offers easy access to the downtown amenities, as well as overnight mooring and power for boaters cruising through the system. Local residents and seasonal tourists alike can spend the day watching the large boats and yachts lock through town. One of the unique aspects of Bob Cajun is the city influence blended with a cozy small town vibe. The town boasts a vibrant main street with an array of shopping and dining options that might surprise you. From boutique shops to upscale restaurants, you won't miss out on the finer things in life. From the infamous Big Lees, who have cornered the shopping market in Bob Cajun, to smaller boutiques, there is something for everyone at every budget. And whether you're in the mood for a leisurely stroll through local galleries or a gourmet meal, Bob Cajun delivers. However, someone looking for easy access to a wide variety of urban amenities may be disappointed. Bob Cajun is a smaller town. And while the big city influence can certainly be seen and felt, you won't find the same range of shopping, dining, and entertainment options as you would in a big city. So if you're used to the conveniences of city living, this could definitely be an adjustment. Bob Cajun comes alive when tourists and cottagers flock to town. While the energy is infectious and there's always something happening, the increased crowds can also mean longer wait times and a bit of traffic. If you're someone who thrives on the excitement of a vibrant summer scene, well, you're going to fit right in. But if you prefer the tranquility of quieter moments, you might find these months a tad overwhelming. Every season brings something new to look forward to in Bob Cajun. Local residents live their lives in this ebb and flow of busy spring and summer days and slower, more leisurely fall and winters. It takes adjusting, and while most full-time residents will tell you that they look forward to Labor Day and the slower fall pace, they will also wait with anticipation for spring and the cycle to start up again. Let's look at the practical side of things. Proximity to major centers. While Bob Cajun offers an amazing slice of paradise, it's important to note that employment opportunities might lead you to commute to larger nearby cities. Many residents commute and can be in Lindsay in about half an hour and to Peterborough in less than an hour. But if you work in Toronto, you can still be in the GTA in a little over an hour. It's a trade-off, 
that some families are willing to make for the idyllic lifestyle Bob Cajun provides their families. Yes, the commute might be a bit longer, but the payoff is coming home to your own island oasis. From the delectable Kawartha Dairy ice cream to the allure of lakeside living, Bob Cajun offers a lifestyle that's truly one of a kind. Just remember, like any place, it's all about finding the balance that suits your preferences and needs. Good point. Mm -hmm. And if a quieter rural community is more your speed, you may want to watch this video about Finland Falls. Located in the heart of the Kawarthas, it offers a strong community vibe with a similar waterfront feel.